Good morning, San Francisco. Better wake up early today and get the coffee pot ready. Commute time down to Silicon Valley in your techie job is 90 minutes with traffic jams and delays headed into the Silicon Valley. In real estate news, expect bidding wars of 10% on any house throughout the San Francisco Bay Area. So how are all you techies doing? How are all you techies doing on this lovely, lovely day? Where are you right now? Your office? 12-hour office day? 12-hour office day? That's very nice. Stuck in them Silicon Valley traffic jams? That's very, very nice. <laughs> That's very, very nice. But anyway, um, so it's like in the 70s, just beautiful day. Um, pretty sunny out. Pretty warm for this time of September. It's middle September. Ski resort will be opening in about a, just under 100 days. The skiing will be pretty good. And you know I got my season pass already. I, I definitely got my season pass already. Now I gotta start saving up for hopefully going to Switzerland this year. Hopefully go to Switzerland in like February, go skiing in Switzerland in January, February. Hopefully save up for that as well. Um, and then I wanna also go to Hawaii. I wanna go to Hawaii as well. I'm not sure when I'll be going there, but I wanna go there too. I haven't been to the tropics in a while, so I definitely wanna go to a tropical area, lay out on a beach with a cold margarita in the sand with the palm trees swaying in the wind. Definitely wanna go to Hawaii. So hopefully we'll be doing that pretty soon as well. Um, but I was reading this article. Yeah, I was reading this article. I'm gonna do another blog update later. <clears throat> when I get home later today, after I go hiking, I'll do another blog update. But I was reading this article about these people in San Francisco, they're making like 100,000 a year and they can't, they can't um, pay their bills. They can't pay their bills. <laughs> they can't pay their bills, they're making six figures. They can't pay their bills, what a joke. Yeah, they bought into that socialist. They bought into that corporatist that corporatist socialism big time. Man, they, they, they bought into the system big time. They bought into the establishment big time. And man, they're suffering for it. They're suffering for it. They got like 50,000 in student loan debt. Man, they're in them Silicon Valley traffic jams. They're working a job 60, 70 hours a week, making 100 grand a year, and they still can't pay their bills and they still can't pay off their student loan debts. <laughs> what a joke, man. They're skipping their vacations too. <laughs> They're skipping their vacations too. I was reading that article as well. These like techies and these these work martyrs in San Francisco. They're skipping their vacations, <laughs> and they're working like 70 hours a week. What a joke, man! What a joke. But but I was curious though. Um, and then, and then they're also like throwing away their children in the daycare facility because their feminist wife, their feminist extremist wife. You know she's gonna work. You know she's gonna work. You know that baby's getting thrown away in the daycare. You know that baby's getting thrown away in the daycare. Total strangers you know, taking care of their children. Children get abused, but that's what they do because they're just addicted to the money. You know, they bought into the corporatist, socialist establishment system, you know, and then they think they're like rebels in San Francisco. <laughs> they think they're like hippies and they're rebels. They ain't no rebels. They ain't no hippies, they ain't no rebels. Those people bought into the establishment so much they pretty much are the establishment, you know what I'm saying? But, but they're suffering for it, man. They're, they're, they're suffering big time. You know, they're working 70 hours a week. They're stuck in traffic jams. They can't buy a house because the prices are like a million dollars. Illegal aliens are just flooding in by the millions. You know, H-1B visa immigrants are flooding in, taking their jobs, making their pay go lower. And they just keep voting for more abuse. They just keep voting for more Democrats. They just keep voting for more abuse. Keep voting for higher prices. Keep voting for higher taxes, higher taxes, lower wages. Oh my God. You've you seen that lady Pocahontas? Oh my God, she becomes a bigger clown every day. That Pocahontas becomes a bigger clown. I think her name's Elizabeth Elizabeth Pocahontas in the Democrat debates. In the Democrat debates, what a joke, man! What a joke, man! This country's going to collapse if she gets elected. Oh my God, this country's going to collapse if she gets elected. Wow, man, wow. And, and the people in San Francisco, you know, they're going to vote for her. <laughs> you know, they're going to vote for her. Like 95% of those people will vote for her. What a joke, man! What a joke. But I was going to say one thing um, to all the people in Silicon Valley, San Francisco, what are you going to be doing this winter? What are you going to be doing this winter? Um, you know, I, I live in a brick house here, here in Ogden, Utah. And um, so we're doing pretty good. Um, and hopefully we'll have some extra money this winter to go skiing in Switzerland. I want to go to Hawaii as well. Definitely want to go to Hawaii. Oh, I got my season pass at the, here in the Utah ski resort. I already got my season pass. That's pretty good. That's already bought and paid for. But, but I was curious. Are you techies planning on going to Switzerland this winter? Are you planning on going to Hawaii this winter? Just, just, just wanted to ask real quick.